So main important part here that is how you will convert this uh, improper into mixed fraction. For another example, why I'm doing this because we have to convert uh, our problem is given in mixed fraction. So if it is given in mixed fraction, so you have to convert in your answer in mixed fraction. So another example, suppose question number two, you will solve. I'm solving question number nine. So I have solved one question for positive addition and the one I'm solving for a subtraction. Three to the six plus one is seven over two minus two ones are two plus one is three over two. And I can see two can be LCM. Yep. Let's do it. That's just four. So it is four over two. That and means two. two. Yeah. Huh? Clear. Yep. Clear. So this one you can solve it. Okay. Now LCM. How I'm getting the LCM? That you understood? Yeah. I know. I learned this. Yeah. Yeah. That's great. That's great. So finding LCM is if this is a single number, you just can multiply. And if there is a values of uh, possible to um, like for this example, if I just just I'm I'm not going to solve it fully. I'm just sharing it. So this is this is two and four. So two and four you can make it as uh, two comma four as two one two two to the four. So two to the four. So your LCM will be four. So you'll take four and do the operation later on. That is twenty two plus. One that means it will be 343 over 4, and uh, you have to make uh, 10 3. So that is very, very important when you are solving a uh, mixed fraction problem. Mm -hmm. I know, I get it. Okay, okay, that's great. That's great. So let's let's begin, uh, begin to solve it again. Mm -hmm. 